Great job, Lewis. If you had just waited for the attack, we wouldn't be in this situation. Look, I'm sorry, okay? I didn't mean for this to happen. How much you've been screwing up lately? I don't know how much more sorry is gonna matter. Hey, screw you, man. I didn't mean to make those mistakes. Enough, both of you. We can't afford this kind of bickering. Not right now. We gotta figure out a way out of this mess. Rise and shine, boys. What are you gonna do with us? We want to do nothing to you. We want to work with you. What? Come with us. Morning, Molly. Oh, morning, Willie. Are you okay? Yeah, yeah, I'm, I'm fine. Thanks for asking. What happened to your face? I, I just, I just fell down the stairs. That's all. You sure? I said I'm fine, okay? I gotta go. I, I can't be late. See you later. place even is this? In all my years of being on criminal grounds, I've never seen anything like this before. Let's just get this over with. Grim Five members, we have an offer to propose to you. What kind of an offer? I'm sorry, I don't think I recognize you as being a member my name's Abraham. I'm their newest recruit. After, um, you know. Pleasure's all mine, Abraham. My name is Richard. And this is my legion. You may be small, but believe me, we can do plenty of damage if we put our minds to it. Violence is our expertise. We understand that you hold vengeance against those shadow men. The guys in suits who run the nightclub, so do we. We don't have much experience on planning, just the violence. But we have plenty of guns, and you seem to handle yourselves against them. How would you like to help us out? Meaning that you join us, and we take them down together. Do you think we can talk about this in private ten minutes or I let my friends cut you up fair enough hey mom you okay honestly no I'm not Ben I'm, I'm sorry that you have to go through this I don't deserve your sympathy, damn it. It was awful of me to cheat on your father. It was stupid. Mom, just, just calm down. I was just so alone after your father left. Or was gone or went missing, I don't know. I thought I would never see him again. God, what kind of mother even am I? We can all find ways to redeem ourselves, Mom. We just have to find a way to show ourselves in a positive light again. Now, I think you should get some rest if you're not feeling well. I don't know if I trust these guys. They have guns, and we don't. Anyone with half a brain knows how to use one. Plus, they're real good with violence and interrogation, something that we're not so good at. They could be valuable to us. We're gonna need all the help we can get, I guess. Well, they seem a bit too brutal, at least for my taste. As long as they trust us and they actually go through with helping us out, that's all that really matters. I'm sorry, I just have a bad feeling about this. Maybe it wouldn't be so bad to do that. After all, Paul told me about this gun store that we could go to. Plus, these guys don't know where we live. May even get lucky and they kill Alan and his men for us. Okay, so... 
we're declining their offer? Yes. We don't need help from these freaks. We can handle those pricks in suits ourselves. Have you made your decision? All this waiting, I've talked it over with my men. They'd be more than happy to help you, Abraham. We don't want your help. What? We hate to disappoint you, but we can handle ourselves, thank you. But they nearly outnumber you, and they have a bigger arsenal. There's five of us and only about six or seven of them left. Plus we know where to buy better guns. We risked our lives to get your stupid asses out of that mess. We understand and appreciate that, but we will manage fine. Now step aside and let us out of here. You know, usually it's about this time I let my legion here sick on you. First they'll cut off your legs. Then they'll feed them to the ravenous dogs out back. But... You are some of the few people we've stumbled upon that seem to be smart and tolerable. If anything, maybe it's better that you turned us down. We're a bit rough around the edges, to say the least. Not many people look to us for help because of our brutality. So, in all honesty, we understand. Okay, I th think it's best that we get going now. Of course. We know your car got wrecked really badly during the shootout, so we left you a new ride out front. It's the black pickup truck parked closest to the door. Well, thank you, Richard, both for saving our lives and for the car. It's a pleasure to help out good and honest folks like you. Safe travels, lads. So you're skilled with that staff now, huh? Yeah, it's pretty cool, isn't it? I'm just more happy to have you back, is all. It was quiet around here without you, and everyone was on edge with you gone. Well, I'm glad that you were all concerned about me while I was gone. Of course we were concerned. You're our family, Blake. Are you okay? <sighs> no. I'm still thinking about that girl. She sounds really special to you, man. She was, Jimmy. She taught me most of this stuff with the staff. And she didn't seem to care for anyone but herself at first, but she cared enough about me and my life to risk her own life to help me escape. You should go find her. Maybe bring her back here. Join the rest of us. Hope this fight that's coming up with Alan we might need more recruits. Cindy suggested the same thing to me the other day. Are you going to? I don't know. I just got back and now with Alan stepping up to fill in for Jeremiah, shit's just so unpredictable these days. Tell me about it. This is the place that Paul was telling me about. Just do what you have to do, man. Basically, don't screw this up. Thanks for the words of encouragement, guys. I feel really confident now. Paul? What are you doing here? Good, you're here. Lewis, this here is Jerry Webler, owner of this here store. This is the jackass you were telling me about? Hey, don't give me that look. You're my best friend, so I can legally call you that myself. Doesn't mean I can't spread it around to other people, either. Alright, so, Lewis. What can I get for you today? I need some guns. And a lot of them. <laughs> 